Good morning, Drone World. First in today's news, a company in Germany that specializes in urban air mobility has done their first demonstration of their electric heavy lifting drone. Volocopter completed their three minute flight test showing how delivery drones can be used within the end to end cargo transportation sector. The Volo drone is an uncrewed, fully electric drone weighing up to 200 kilograms also boasting a 40 kilometer range. Volocopter are committed to building the world's first sustainable and scalable urban air mobility service, bringing affordable air taxis to mega cities worldwide. We're excited to see their developments in the future. Stop! Are you subscribed to our YouTube channel? We are closing in on 5,000 subscribers and to say thank you, we're giving away a brand new Mavic Mini 2. All you need to do to enter is subscribe to our channel and comment on our latest video. We'll see you at 5,000 subs. Whether you're using your drone to record your medieval roleplay, film chimpanzees, or are trying to get some cool forest shots but encounter an angry eagle, you'll wish you had your drone covered. Our experts Steve and Danny are joined by Cover Drone's Daniel Dodd on Thursday at 10 a.m. To get the insider tips on how to get the best policy available, click the link in the description to sign up. And please don't be this guy. Our last story comes from Coventry Police, who have successfully been using drones to arrest nuisance bikers who have been riding around the former Door Mill Colliery. The off-road biking team used the technology to check out the riders from the skies on October the 17th, leading to the detainment of five people. Drones have been used up and down the country to support the efforts against crime. Earlier this year, we heard from Stuart Rahman from Cleveland Police Force and he told us a little bit about how they've been using drones in order to fight crime. The type of things we'll use it for is assisting with area searches of vulnerable people who may go missing. We do have a lot of rural areas and built up areas also. We also use it in operations alongside our traffic section, tag and off-road vehicles. Uh, we work in partnership with the Fire Brigade. We've got Eston Hills nearby. It's quite a hotspot for antisocial behavior and uh, arson. So mainly in the summer we get quite a lot of fires up there, so we use it to survey the damage alongside the fire brigade. Thank you for joining us on this week's Good Morning Drone World. Tune in next week to hear more on all things drone.